y'all welcome back to my channel welcome back new subscribers thank you so much for subscribing I really do appreciate the subscribers that I've been getting lately um, thank you to the new blog subscribers there's over 500 and 30 something subscribers to my blog but it's also like my Google Plus friends but also it's that that's the audience that um, does get to see my blog so don't forget to follow me on Google Plus add me and you'll be able to get more um, current updates This is a simple makeup look that I always do. I've been really into purple lately. It's just purple eyes, mascara, my natural lashes, no false lashes, no black uh, eyebrows, and no um, extra white highlighter. Like I said, those are for my dramatic looks when I really want to make my makeup pop, when I want to get into like my Barbie doll mood and, you know, have my little Barbie doll attitude. So anyway, this is a natural makeup tutorial uh, just to show you how you can do your makeup if you don't, you know, if you're unsure of how to do your makeup with your natural hair now. So please stay tuned for this video and thank you guys for watching. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to start out doing is by taking my Italia Eyeliner in brown and I'm just going to line up my eyebrows. Next, I'm going to use my Mary Kay Concealer in Bronze 1 to highlight and give a arch to my eyebrows. I'm going to use that same bronze one concealer to uh, create a base on my eyelids for my uh, eyeshadow. For my eyeshadow, I'm going to use my City Color Compact that I got from City Trends. It was $3.99 and as you can see, it's a rainbow of colors and I'm going to go with the lightest purple color to apply to the inner corner of my eyelid. Now I'm going to use the darker purple in my compact and I'm going to apply that to the outer corner of my eyelids. And then I'm going to use that same light purple that I used for the inner corner on the bottom lower lash line to give it a nice highlight. And now for a pop of drama, I'm going in with my L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. Next I'm going to go in with the same bronze one concealer by Mary Kay. To highlight my face, I'm going to apply that to my T-zone area and um, my cheekbones and also to add some highlight underneath my eyes and to cover up any bags, I'm going to add a dab of Ivory One Concealer next to contour my face to slim my nose and to also contour the rest of my face, I use the Mary Kay Mineral Foundation Powder in Bronze 3. Next is my Imori blush. I'm just going to quickly dab that to the cheeks. Also, I'm going to use my Italia eyeliner in brown to line my lips. And then I'm going to apply the L'Oreal lipstick number 417 Peach Fuzz. And that's a nice, cute, peachy, neutral color that goes perfect with the bright, dramatic eyes. Now I'm just blending out the makeup to mask any little imperfections, anything that uh, might seem out of place such as too much um, concealer. I just need to blend that in my, with my skin and to make it look more natural. And that's it. That's how I do my makeup with my natural hair. Um, this is my go-to look. It's my favorite look because it's simple, it's easy, it's fast. Um, and I don't have to spend too much time on it, but I can still, you know, feel confident in how my face looks and 
what I'm wearing. Speaking of what I'm wearing. So I got this cute dress from Room 21 for only $5. They was having a spring blowout sale because you know they're gonna get new merchandise for the spring and the summer. This is, well, I guess this must have been last season's fashion. Um, the tight maxi dress has definitely been in for at least a year or two now. You know where it's hugging you and showing off your curves. So I decided to get one. Um, um, I got these shoes at City Trends, and they were like $6.99. Um, they got cute embellishments on them. And then I got these rings. Uh, I decided to go with the Nene Leaks white fingernail polish. You know, Nene Leaks be rocking that white fingernail polish, so I just wanted to try it out. Um, so, yeah, this is the end of the video. Um, let me know if you guys have any questions. Please feel free to like the video and comment. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you, new subscribers. I've had a ton of new subscribers and I'm so grateful for y'all because it makes me want to really um, do more videos and give out a little bit more information you know share a little bit of me and so I really do I really do appreciate each and every one of my subscribers you know being in the 300 hiatus you definitely learn how to appreciate the people who did stick around plus the new newcomers that are coming so anyway Thanks for watching. Um, I think I'm going to do an eight months uh, lock video because it's time. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Bye. <laughs>